Welcome to Hard Dollar Self-Paced Product Training, Foundation Setup Data Lesson. This lesson will provide you with a basic overview of setting up the Master Foundation Setup Data in the library. The four tabs covered in this lesson are Resource Files, Geographic Areas, Wage Zones, and Organizational Categories. All data that is set up in the library will be automatically brought into new job folders when they are created. This section will discuss the setup of the resource files information for the Master Foundation setup data. Every job folder created will automatically include this resource files information by default. Once the job is created, the contents can be edited within the individual job folder. Resource files are used to identify and categorize individual resource and resource assembly data so that you can better identify it or find it when you need it. In addition, when importing resources into a job folder on the Job Properties Cost Basis form, you can order Hard Dollar to import resources identified with a certain resource file name. Once resource data is assigned a resource file, it can be filtered and grouped using the filter and grouping features on the register containing the data. A master set of resource files is created and stored in the library. When you create a new folder, the master set is automatically copied from the library to the new job folder. To create a new resource file description, click on the small green burst located just above the Master Foundation Setup Data tabs. Enter the description for the new resource file. Click the OK button to close the library resource file record. This section will discuss the setup of the geographic areas information for the Master Foundation Setup Data. Every job folder created will automatically include this geographic area's information by default. Once the job is created, the contents can be edited within the individual job folder. Geographic areas are used to identify and categorize individual resource and resource assembly data so that you can better identify it when you need it. In addition, when importing resources into a job folder on the Job Properties Cost Basis page, you can order Hard Dollar to import resources identified with a certain geographic area name. Once resource data is assigned a geographic area, it can be filtered and grouped using the filter and grouping features on the register containing the data. A master set of geographic areas is created and stored in the library. When you create a new folder, the master set is automatically copied from the library to the new job folder. To create a new geographic area description, click on the small green burst located just above the Master Foundation Setup Data tabs. Now we will enter the description for the new geographic area. Next, we'll click the OK button to close the geographic area record. This section will discuss the setup of the wage zones information for the Master Foundation Setup Data. Every job folder created will automatically include this wage zones information by default. Once the job is created, the contents can be edited within the individual job folder. Wage zones are used to identify and categorize individual resources and resource assembly data so that you can better identify it or find it when you need it. In addition, when importing resources into a job folder on the Job Properties Cost Basis page, you can order Hard Dollar to import resources identified with a certain geographic area name. Once resource data is assigned a wage zone, it can be filtered and grouped using the filtering and grouping features on the register containing that data. A master set of wage zones is created and stored in the library. When you create a new folder, the master set is automatically copied from the library to the new job folder. This time, we will enter our description directly on the register view rather than creating a new record as we did in our previous examples. This section will discuss the setup of the organizational categories information for the Master Foundation setup data. Every job folder created will automatically include this organizational categories information by default. Once the job is created, the contents can be edited within the individual job folder. Organizational categories are used to identify and categorize individual resource and resource assembly data so that you can better identify it or find it when you need it. In addition, when importing resources into a job folder on the Job Properties Cost Basis form, you can order Hard Dollar to import resources identified with a certain organizational category name. Once resource data is assigned an organizational category, 
It can be filtered and grouped using the filtering and grouping features on the register containing the data. A master set of organizational categories is created and stored in the library. When you create a new job folder, the master set is automatically copied from the library to the new job folder. Once again, we will enter our description directly on the register view. Now we will click on the gray X in the upper right corner to close the Master Foundation Setup Data Form. Congratulations, you have just completed the lesson. This lesson covered the following topics. Setting up resource files, geographic areas, wage zones, and organizational categories in the Master Foundation Setup Data.